everybody, it is me Alice and today I'm going to be doing a November favourites because it is almost the end of November which feels so strange because I feel like November has gone so fast which means, which is just weird because in like 11 days or something like that it will be December which means it will almost be Christmas. I'm so excited for Christmas honestly guys. This month has been like the, the month where I have tried out a lot of new things because I have spent um, a lot of money this month I've got to say on a lot of things which I've really wanted and I'm so happy I bought them because they have become my new favourites and I can't wait to show you so without further ado let's go on the video. Starting off with clothes, I have this lovely red jumper from Misguided. It just has like a like kind of like a turtleneck, I think, or it's raw neck or turtleneck, I'm not really sure. But it's just like a lovely red knitted jumper. And this month I have became obsessed with red, like red and pink are my two favourite colours. As you can probably tell, pink walls and pink everything and just red. I just love wearing red. I don't know what my obsession is. It's ever since I got my prom dress, like it was red, I just became obsessed with it, but yeah this is super comfortable and I think it's around £22 from Misguided and honestly guys, Misguided have tons of beautiful jumpers on there, I have quite a few from there now and the prices aren't too bad either so it is worth having a look and this is just so nice and I literally wear this in, like in most of my videos now and I'm just obsessed with it so yeah, definitely have a, have a look on their website because they've got a lot of lovely jumpers. As you may know, I am a massive makeup fan. I buy new makeup products probably every month because, like, I love to try out new things and companies are bringing out new makeup, like, every every week. Like, it's actually mental, like, Makeup Revolution, NYX, um, Morphe. Can we just talk about the new James Charles Morphe eyeshadow palette? It is absolutely stunning. It's got like every colour of the rainbow in there and it's just absolutely gorgeous. So I really want that but it is around £40 or something like that. So I'm just going to leave it. However, anyway, but a new, um, bit like a new, no, a few new items of makeup which are now my staples for every day. So I'm just going to show you them. So starting off with this obsession eyebrow pomade. I bought this in Boots I think a week ago or something like that. It's £6 and I've got it in the shade medium brown because my natural eyebrow colour have gone a lot darker so I have got brown eyebrows and my hair is slowly turning a bit browner as well. Like it's it is like it blondes at the end but it's quite dark still. So I bought this from Boots and this is the makeup obsession one. Like honestly the makeup obsession eyeshadows, I have a few of them and they're really good and this eyebrow pomade as well is a perfect tube for the Anastasia one. I think the Anastasia one's about £19 which is a lot of money. So this is worth um buy in because it's super good and it lasts it is waterproof and it lasts a long time on my brows i've got it on today as you can tell and i love it so this is going straight in my basket from superdrug i bought this revolution pro concealer um revolution has like three brands so it's like revolution and then i heart makeup and then the revolution pro and their pro range is absolutely amazing and this concealer is in the shade c1 and i use it usually like on my eyelids and under my eyes now and for under eye concealer it's got the best coverage ever for like your bags and like your dark circles i'm not even joking i don't even have to use any any color corrector and um, you only have to use this tiny amount and it goes a long way as well and this is five pounds which is super good for a concealer because like most concealers these days can be like 15 pounds which is a lot so this is worth forking out for and i've dropped it but it's very good and it's just so good so i just love it as you know i'm, I'm obsessed with concealers and stuff so yeah next i have my kat von d foundation i'm sure i've mentioned this in a few of my videos before because this is like the kind of like the only foundation which i use these days but it's just the lock it foundation and mine's in the shade i like 44 cool because i am very pale and this has the best coverage like all of all drugstore and high-end foundations i have to say this one has the best coverage and um if you do have oily skin this is perfect because it <laughs> It is a matte finish and it'll make your face look all nice and matte which is perfect because oil skin people know how foundations can come off their face and can make them look a bit more oily sometimes. However this one stays on all day and literally is locked on your skin as it says here, lock it. 
is so good so it is worth a fork now I think it is around 27 pounds but it is worth it because I I've not tried any other foundations apart from this now so I love it next I have a I heart makeup blushing hearts triple baked blusher I don't use it as a blusher I use it as a highlight this is just in this is the one in the shade Peachy Pink Kisses and this is around, I think it's like 4 99 from Superdrug. I use like these two shades here and it makes you glow to the gods. Obviously I don't have any highlight on today because I had to rush my makeup but um, usually I wear this every day and this is just such a beautiful highlighter like for pale people like me. Um, it is worth having a look again. I love it so much. And then finally for makeup favourites I have my LA Girl Wispy Mascara. I bought this for £6.00. On Beauty Bay, obviously um, LA Girl is an American brand and the only place where you can really buy it is Beauty Bay and obviously so sometimes you have to pay a little bit more to get free postage like I do but um, I bought this for £6 and I, I, I really needed a new mascara but like there wasn't really any like in like super drug which were like oh my god I need it but I had a look online and saw this and said with me and I like to have wispy eyelashes so I tried it out and it was only £6 which is cheaper than, than a few drugstore mascaras so I bought it and I'm not even joking it makes your lashes look super long and it's just super pretty and it, it doesn't like clump on your eyelashes which is the best because as you may know girls and boys who wear makeup and wear mascara a lot can clump sometimes but this one is super good I'm just going to show you the wand as well the wand is very nice, I love it. For home stuff, I have been loving this Saffron Barker Reed Diffuser. Um, this, I think I've had this probably about three weeks and I'm not even joking, it's almost finished already. But this makes your room smell nice. I have this one in Pecan Waffles, I think. I don't know if it has a name of it, but I'm sure it's Pecan Waffles. And I have to say, Primax Reed Diffusers, I have had a few of them in the past. And they honestly last a long time and they smell so nice as well. And this was, I think it was like £6 or something like that, which is really reasonable. And the packaging is so cute as well. And this smells of waffles, as it says in the description. And these fill your room up with the scent. And as you can tell, it's very strong. Um, but yeah, this is very good. And Primark Reed Diffusers are the best. So you need to definitely have a look because... They are amazing. Finally, moving on to kind of like body stuff and like body mists and everything. I have been using my hand food. This is just the one in the scent smoothie star, which like it's more like uh, it's it's almond and um, vanilla, which is very good. And I've been using this a lot just because at work recently I've been in the kitchen and obviously I've been like cleaning the dishes. I've been in and out of water, which means my hands have dried up a lot. So I have been using this a lot and my hands feel moisturised as hell. Like this is super good and um, I think the full size of this is around £6 and obviously the small one is two fifty. It is worth buying these because my mum uses like the hand food and they, they work a miracle on her hands. So it is worth getting one because especially in the winter time it's like really cold. Like everyone gets dry hands and... It can be just a sore sometimes, so it is worth getting this because it, this does make your hands very moisturised. My final favourite of this video is my Victoria's Secret Jasmine Noir Noir Spray, and this is obviously from Victoria's Secret. And um, I think this was about three weeks ago, maybe a month ago. I'm not sure. Um, I went to Victoria's Secret for the first time in Glasgow, and I have to say it's one of the prettiest shops I've ever been in. Like. It's just so cute and all the underwear and all the sprays and just everything about Victoria's Secret Pink is just so beautiful. Um, but I bought this spray just because I have got a few of like the old VS sprays in the old packaging but I've not tried any from the new packaging. I'm sure this is a new spray as well. This smells so nice and I just love using it. I, I, I probably, I use this every day and it just smells really nice. Um, so it's really good and this was I think around Oh my god, I'm gonna choke on this spray. I've just got a mouthful of it anyway. This spray is around 12, 14 pounds. Um, so it's worth getting it because it's very nice. And the sprays and perfumes in Victoria's Secret are all beautiful. And the packaging is the bomb, as you can tell. 
um, I'll be keeping this forever. <laughs> so guys, this is the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up and a comment down below and I'll see you at my next video. Bye! <laughs>